Right now, it's the fall season and it's the time of year when leaves change color on plants. Part of the reason that leaves change color is because of the day length. And so as the days grow shorter and shorter, the leaves start to get the cues that they can change color. The northeastern United States actually has really beautiful colors and here in Colorado, plants like the cottonwoods or the aspens up higher in the mountains will change color. The fact that there are transitions in our climate and that there are transitions in the colors is just really spectacular because it's, it's like a painted landscape. And so every year, the, the colors turn from green to yellows and reds and oranges, and then they turn to brown and fall off. And so just having that, the, the change in color through time, I think is, is a really pretty spectacular phenomenon for plants. The color change does serve a purpose and realizing that the plants are, they're not dying. They invest a lot of resources into their leaves. And so during the fall, when the leaves start to change color, they're taking back and recapturing some of those nutrients so that they can use them for the next year. When the leaves fall off, they don't just stay on the ground, they actually decompose. And so the nutrients that are left in the leaf that the plant didn't take back into the stem are then put on the ground and there, there are tiny microbes. They break down those leaves and they actually put the nutrients back in the soil so that the plants can potentially capture some of those nutrients the following year. Nature is, is a pretty powerful and amazing force. You get to really see the beauty that nature brings and the fact that we can change things like climate, but the plants are still gonna have these annual cycles of the leaves falling off. It will follow its patterns regardless of whether or not we're here. Mm -hmm.